because it kind of cuts off the bottom. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Hack Spot. Today, I'm going to show you how to make an iPhone, <laughs> an Android, an Android, and iPhones. Oh my god. Alright, what's up guys, and welcome back to the Hack Spot. Now, before I start this video, guys, we are so close to 200,000 subscribers. I honestly did not think we would reach that so quickly. It's just so soon, but I'm so grateful. You guys sharing and liking my videos keeps the fresh content coming. But anyways, today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to play NES games without a joke break and without a computer on your iOS device and also without an app, so this cannot be revoked. And this is through the Safari browser. It's so, so cool. All right, so again, guys, thank you so much. We are so close to 200,000 subscribers. Take a look at this, guys. Wow. So what do you guys want me to do for 200,000 subscribers, my video special? That is totally going to be up to you guys again. I was thinking maybe a setup tour. Many of you guys have been wanting to see that. I don't know what's on my iPhone. Another prank. Let me know down below in the comments. But yeah, I'm trying to work on getting a new intro, so that's going to be cool too. Although it might not be here on time. That's okay though. All right, so again, this NES emulator works straight through a Safari browser. No app needed. So I'm going to show you guys how to install games, all that good stuff in this one video today. So what you want to do is open up your Safari browser and click on the link that will be down below inside the description. I'll bring you right over here. Now, let's see, we have some preloaded games. This one right here, the Super Mario Bros. I downloaded that myself. But these are the games that come like pre installed. So let's go ahead and tap on one to show you guys how it works. Take a look at this. And very, very cool stuff. All the buttons work. The only thing is that sound doesn't really work that well. But other than that, everything does work. And uh, not sure how to play this game. But yeah, let me show you guys Super Mario Bros. real quick. So all I'm going to do is tap on this. And. You can play like this too, but it kind of cuts off, so it doesn't really work in landscape mode at the moment. That needs to be fixed because it kind of cuts off the bottom. Yeah, see like that checker, like floor? It doesn't show up in landscape, so that needs to be fixed, but this is like a small project, but it's really, really cool. So look at this. I could just go ahead and play without any app. This can't be revoked, and it's just so, so cool. Let's get a mushroom. All right. So this is really cool to play on the go when you have nothing to do. You don't have any space on your device. This is good. Why can't I jump? Oh my god. Ugh, come on. Okay. I give up. So that's that. Now, how do you get more games? Now, it's pretty simple. What you guys will need is your Dropbox account. So from the App Store, I would download these two applications. So again, the links will be down below in the description. The first one is, of course, Dropbox. And this is what we're going to do to like put our games. So this is where our games are going to be stored. Now, we also need another app called ZipRR Tool. Now, this is basically to extract the files so that they can be playable. So you will need this as well. I'm going to go and download this too. And pretty quick, as you guys can see right here, and it's already done. Now, it's very, very simple, guys. I know there are a lot of links, but what you want to do is open up your Safari browser now. Head over to this website emu paradise the link again will be down below inside the description and here you can search for any game that you want to download uh let's just go to do something other than mario so i'm gonna just type in let's say kirby okay and here we are now what you want to do first is go over here and where it says roms first you want to click on slow slash hide all and then it will uncheck all of them and now you want to go and check nes rom so there it is that's the only one that you want to have checked so click on one of these games down over here so you can scroll down this kirby's adventure all these other games that guys could download. So I'm going to do this one, Kirby's Adventure USA. Now we do scroll down, and it'll have number six, download links. Tap on that. Now you can see you can download it right there. Just tap on download. And scroll down over to here. You guys will see that we do have a download link again. And here right here, we have a save to Dropbox option. So of course, guys, you want to sign into your Dropbox app and basically create an account if you don't have one. And once you are signed into your account, tap on save to Dropbox. Now I'll bring it to a new page. You're going to just save it right here. There's a save button on the bottom. But if this does not pop up, I haven't been having this issue before. So, for example, I think it's going to happen now. Watch. If I'm going to tap on it. Oh, it's still working. Okay. But if that doesn't happen and you cannot save like that, then what you want to do is tap on this link up here and it'll bring up this right here. So tap on more. And if you scroll through this list, there will be an import with Dropbox option. So you can tap on that from there too. And again, same thing will happen. Let's go ahead and hit save. And there you go done so there are two ways to import to dropbox use whichever way it works for you but now as i see it's a dot zip file so we do need to unzip it so it could work and be playable so for that we want to go back to this application over here zip tool and this is very easy to use guys so all you have to do is go to the cloud option and sign into your dropbox account so tap on dropbox sign into your dropbox head over to the folder click on the game and hit download file now hit OK, and that part is done. Now you can go back to your files over here. You guys will see the .zip now in zip tool, so tap on it. Do you want to unzip the file? 
hit OK, and done. Simple as that. Now, what you want to do is go back to Cloud, tap on Edit, Upload, and here inside this folder, you will find the playable game. So just tap on it, hit Done, and it'll start uploading it to your Dropbox account. So that is it, guys. Now you are done. I know it may seem like a lot of steps at first glance, but it's really very, very quick. It takes like... 15 20 seconds once you get how to do it and once you have the apps installed and everything you're signed in so now what we want to do is go back to the emulator right here so now to add the game to here tap on the plus button it'll bring it to your dropbox tap on your folder what the heck what happened to my voice i got like a weird like accent i guess i still do have an accent but anyways there's kirby's adventure there's going to tap on it hit choose now you can add multiple games at a time as you guys can see but uh okay so uh that is kind of messed up right here if it doesn't load properly, just go to add it again. I'm just going to go to remove this too right here. You guys already saw Mario working. Okay, and there it is, Kirby's Adventure. So let's go and tap on it. Looks like this Kirby's Adventure is broken. Let's go and try out a different game. All right, so I just downloaded Dr. Mario for Japan and USA. And I'm glad that Kirby didn't work because it does show that this is not perfect. There are some games that may not work, but Mario works really, really well. So also, there is a neat little trick. So you have a bigger screen on the top. So to do that, all you got to do is tap right here. Go over to add to home screen. Tap on add, and there now we have the icon. So go ahead and tap on this. Again, it's to re-add the game, so let's go back over here. Let's go to our folder, Dr. Mario, choose. All right, so sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but right now it doesn't seem to want to cooperate. It says unable to close and can't really close the window. So let's go play in our browser, Dr. Mario Japan. So there it is. Go select like players. I don't know how two-player work. I guess you take turns. But there you go, everything is working. Alright, so really do hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Again, let me know what I should do for 200,000 subscribers. Leave it down below in the comments. And be sure to hit that like button and get subscribed for tons more content. You don't want to miss out. And of course, you want to be in that under 200,000 subscribers group. So again, just subscribe. And I'll catch you guys real soon. Peace out. In a room for the haters, ain't got time for jealousy I'm too focused on the music, the money and where I'm headed Never ran on my parade, I'ma get an umbrella <laughs> Fuck all the damn opinions Never really been the one to listen Ain't no one else in the world, so my vision Still I want the distance and stay driven Gotta go for it, do or die, I can't slow down I feel too alive